Hey everyone, in this video, we shall learn how to open a port on a Linux machine's firewall. In order to demonstrate this, I have got a Linux host, as you can see, and it is currently in a problematic state. And it says the Zabbix agent is not available on it. I have been told that the ports 10050 and 10051, the default Zabbix agent ports, are not open on the Linux host, due to which the server is showing in a problematic state. What we will do is we will log in on to the Linux host and open those ports and see if the problem gets resolved on our Zabbix front end. Let's go ahead. So in order to open a port, we must have the firewall service installed on our machine. So I'm going to run yum install firewall D hyphen Y in order to install the firewall D service. As the firewall D service is already installed on my machine, I'm going to run firewall hyphen CMD hyphen hyphen list hyphen ports to see the open ports on my machine. As you can see, there are no open ports on this machine, on the firewall. Now what we will do, we will run firewall hyphen CMD hyphen hyphen permanent hyphen hyphen add port add hyphen port I'm sorry and the port number along with slash TCP in the end. And we will also do the same command for port 10051. Once we have the successful message, we need to restart our firewall D service for the changes to take place. Now let's head back to our Zabbix server and see if the problem is in a resolved state or not. We shall wait for a few minutes in order to see if this problem gets resolved on the Zabbix front end. Great, as you can see, the problem is appearing in a resolved status now. As we open the port, the connectivity between our Zabbix server and this Linux host got established and the monitoring of this Linux host is back on. I would like to thank you for watching this video and I'll see you next time.